Okay, we're back in the garage. I'm gonna zip this motor apart and see uh, see how bad it is. Looks actually really good. You got a nice uh, cardboard brown. Oh, that's mint. Uh, let's see. I'll get this cover off. Cut all the head bolts out. We're going to pull the head off. Cylinder head. Looks fine, a little carboned up. And uh, cylinder walls, they are scored up, but man, it doesn't look as bad as, as you think it would be. It's actually not that bad. I can't touch anything, it's so hot. Hmm, interesting. Okay, it seized up pretty good. I'm going to try to spin the motor over with the impact on. I got it to turn. Maybe we'll take it apart a little further and investigate more. Okay, got the motor off. Got the stupid uh, blade attachment thing off, which sucked. Now I'm going to zip this bottom cover off. Take a look inside here. Nice, we got some gravel inside of there. There actually was quite a bit of oil left. I drained it and let it drain, but there's actually quite a bit in there. But definitely a lot of gravel in there, so oil or not. Let's look at the cam. Man, it's hot. Cam, it actually looks pretty good. Like I can't, I don't know if it's gonna focus there. But it doesn't look too bad. These old Tecumseh engines are so tough. I'm really impressed with them. It's just so much, 
so much gravel in there. I'm gonna pull the crank out and the piston. So I got the engine disassembled and <laughs> as you can see there's still a lot of gravel and sludge inside of here. But when I look at like the the crank, it's actually in decent shape. This won't focus. Oh, there it goes. See, it looks like it's in pretty decent shape, which I'm blown away by that. Um, you know, we look at the cam. Cam lobes look really good. Uh, the tappets, they look really good. Now the piston, I'm going to try to wipe it down. That's pretty tore up. So the piston did take a beating. It scored up pretty bad. There's even shavings and stuff. And then the cylinder, if you look inside, I'm gonna wipe some of this sludge out of here. <laughs> you can see the cross hatch, but that's where the piston doesn't touch. Or the rings anyway, because above it, it looks really bad. So I got it propped up. Clean it out here. Oh yeah. Scratched up pretty bad. Oh yeah, I can feel it with my nail. So, that's what happens to an engine when you drain out the oil and you put sand in it and a camera that won't focus there it goes so hopefully maybe somebody learned something maybe you I don't know what you learned I didn't learn anything I thought it wouldn't last three minutes but there you go